one of these real serious producers who produces serious, serious movies and stuff to really put it together to get the true capacity of of really what it's about. Man, it would take study and research. But if we ever were to do that, I think that would be great. I mean, with Lazy Bone getting shot in his head and, and Flesh and Bone carrying him to the doctor to crazy accidentally shooting Wish to all of the beautiful things that Bone has went through to make us love our brotherhood more so than what we would normally if we didn't go through it. All of those things, man, put together, it's it's one hell of a story, brother, and we all have it, you know, everybody in the world. And between us five, it ain't brother in the hood that ain't going to understand us. We got the whole thing covered. Now, now I just want to back up a minute. Now, I heard, I heard about um, Crazy accidentally shooting Wish, but I, I didn't know Lazy was shot in the head. When, when did that happen? Uh, well, uh, um, actually, Lay was up at the uh, up at the old school that him and Crazy had met at Empire, and um, got into some stuff with some guys, and you know, uh, they got into a scrap with some fellas, and they were a little younger, and you know, somebody pulled out a deuce deuce and hit him in the back of the head behind of his ear, Damn. and the bullet actually fell out of his ear um, while um, while his brother was carrying him. Like like his brother was carrying him, running with him home to, you know, to Mama P house. And um, he survived. He lost his hearing for a brief second. And you know what I mean? But he, he pulled through, man, by the grace, man. You know what I'm saying? We Bone wouldn't be bone without that brother. So it worked out for the best. But, you know, man, there's so many thug stories, man, for us. You know, you know, we're a little older now. You know what I'm saying? I'm 36 years old myself. You know what I mean? So... You know, we went through it when we were 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We made it with easy, but all the years up until then, man, it's like that real true grit, no bullshit, no fabrication. You know, grown men now, but, man, we were some wild little niggas. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell for notifications, like, comment, share. Also go over to UGSForLife.com, download the entire archive, and check out new episodes on Apple Podcasts and Blog Talk Radio.